Okay, in Rhino, now let's open meter template. Um, and I'm going to type import uh, command in Rhino and we will import the geometry we export the previous uh, tutorial. Okay, that is um, here located. Copy and paste, pass. And we'll import this um, geometry in here. As you can see now, there is no uh, segments uh, from Revit because this is a single model line instead of actual beam object in Revit. Now let's go ahead uh, separate these um, layers in R Rhino. So I'm going to make each layer say loop rich beam for the first layer and I'll make this to rename it to laughter beam and so on column we'll make it and first we'll make web and next one we'll make it to post and then we'll make um, one of them to top cord which is existing one and the bottom one will make it to bottom code layer and I'll leave default layer as a work layer alright these are um, could be very important because uh, sometimes it's um, easy to use pipe geometry pipeline component in Grasshopper to um, analyze your structure so I'm going to go through these steps and show you how we can do it in Karamba First of all, let's um, we have to change this geometry to its layer. So I'm going to go here. This is these are top chord, which is actually the, we don't need to change these guys. Let's change the center here. This post to post layer and um, side oops, undo that side these webs. We're going to change to web layer. And we'll make these columns to column layer, change to column layer, and top code, bottom code, we'll leave it, make it this bottom code, bottom code layer, change layer. So we have bottom code, and of course we have to make now loop list beam. Mm, simply go, I'm going to select them all, and deselect these guys. So let's leave, change this layer to change reach beam. And what else we need to do is to do, do, do okay, we need to also convert this reach beam as uh, sorry the laughter beams to change to our reach beam layer. Okay, so that's okay. We will send to laughter beam layer change object layer. Then we are ready to analyze uh, this Rhino model in Grasshopper, uh, in Karamba. So I'm going to type Grasshopper to open Grasshopper and let's go ahead we'll type geometry pipeline in this case geometry pipeline. This is one of the good example how we can use Rhino model to analyze in um, in, in in re in Karamba, all right. We'll specify double click as a curve, and we'll copy and paste each layer name into geometry pipeline layer. So we have one. It's done. I'm going to copy and paste, and let's copy laughter beam layer name, copy, and columns. We'll copy and paste this component. Make it column double click on that and I copy and paste let's make it to web layer name so geometry pipeline is just getting all the curve that which belong to each layer structure okay post and top chord copy and paste top chord copy and paste and copy to bottom chord layer so we have our um, sorry, our Rhino now reference uh, our Grasshopper referenced each uh, component into um, Grasshopper. 